So January is upon us, and that got me thinking about, whoa, 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 wait. We're not going to talk about the massive elephant in the room. Is it the fact that it's kind of been a while since I last posted a video? No, it's the fact that you've, you know, visibly aged. I haven't visibly aged. Okay, if I've aged, then you've aged. We're the same. No, see, you keep getting older, but I'll be 20 forever. That's not how this works. Uh, how else do you think I've maintained my sense of youthful wonder and whimsy? I don't know if I think that's true. Why do they make jars so hard to get open? If you don't bet it all on a daily double, you're gonna have a tough time going into double jeopardy, my friend. Oh, it's the start of a new fiscal quarter, and you know what that means. Time to start a new tax expense spreadsheet. Yeah, okay. The fact of the matter is, I have aged. We've all aged. That's a part of life. Um, with respect to my online life, my first YouTube video was uploaded on January 13th of 2010. It's now January 13th of 2020, meaning that 10 years have passed since my very first YouTube video. Not only does the year 2020 feel like something so far into the future that we should all at least be dressing like Xenon girl of the 21st century by now, but the fact that it's been 10 years since I first uploaded a video just truly boggles my mind. I was a college student when I first started vlogging. It was my junior year of college and I had gotten really into watching YouTube and I thought that I would give it a try. Now 10 years later I've graduated college, I moved to a new city, I started and finished a PhD in cell biology, I published five books, the fifth of which is just very recently out. And through all of that I've carried with me my experiences on YouTube. I got to meet so many incredible people as a result of this channel and these videos. I got to travel to cool places to make new friends. I got to get involved in different YouTube projects like How to Adult. And I'm just so incredibly grateful for the experiences I've gotten to have because of these videos and because of you. So I just wanted to hop on today and say thank you so much for, for watching my videos over the years, for reading my books, if, if you've checked any of them out, for talking to me online on Twitter or Instagram or Tumblr. Thank you for, for all the joy that you've brought into my life and for kind of transforming the last decade for me. I so appreciate it. If you want to leave me a comment today, let me know how you've been, what you've been up to. I would love to hear from you. And in the meantime, did someone say retrospective? I patently did not say retrospective. Just a cheeky little montage. Fine. But if it's just a poorly compiled slideshow set to the tune of We Didn't Start the Fire, then I don't... No Frodo wind machine, narwhals, lots of teas, birthday dumping, many laughs, baby giraffe, Elma 5 video. Oh. I've missed this for us.